hi guys welcome back to my channel i hope y'all had a wonderful valentine's day thank you so much for subscribing to my channel for those who are new here hi my name's amelia nice to have you remember like share comment and subscribe to the video i'll show you some quick and easy steps to achieve this ponytail let's go My hair is nice and clean and I'm just combing it through. It is of awkward length. In Jamaica, we would really say that girl your hair dry. But I'm just making a part right here at the back and then I'm gonna go in again and make a semi part um, just to um, get this style to perfection because I have literally no hair in the middle. So guys, that little part that I just um, took out, I am going to put some braiding here right there that's gonna help me to secure the ponytail remember i don't have a lot of hair to make a not even a tiny weeny teeny beeny pony so i'm gonna need some help from my sisters so to braid that i am just gonna separate the braiding too and then i'm gonna make a loop like this and then I'm, that's the loop i am going to take this half and then put my fingers through so i can start back and i am not going to use that Part to make just one flat I am going to make two the reason being I don't want to bulge when I try to catch my hair all together oh and it doesn't have to be neat guys remember it's gonna be in a ponytail nobody will know how will they know so here I go I proceed to make my flat and I'm not gonna flat it all the way down I just want something to hold it a little tighter than I would um, usually have my hair. I'm also going to slightly knot it because I don't want to plait it all the way down like I said. I need this part of the braid in here to blend with the braid that I'm going to use to make my ponytail. So I'm just tying it right here. Okay, that'll do. And then I'm gonna pat this other half right here. A lot of people when they're catching their hair, they like to do it section by section and add some gel and then continue down the next section. For me, I think it's easier when I brush everything back and then I catch it all together and then add the gel because once I add that gel before catching, it's so hard for me to grip it. Everything just keeps sliding away. So I usually brush, get it all together, and then I proceed to add the gel and use my comb to sleek it down. So this is my attempt. This is it so far guys, and then I'm going to proceed to add the gel to get it all together. So see, I needed this bad boy. I am going to be using my Eco Styling Gel to finish off this look. Tie it with my hair scarf and uh, let it drop. So now I'm going to take down my scarf. 
see it's coming so I'll be using this pre-stretched um, braiding hair from Petra braids. It is 36 inches and this is what I'll use to do my ponytail. Um, let me just take it out of the pack. Once I have the hair out of the pack, I am just going to take that elastic band off that usually separates it. Okay, so now that it's out, I am going to take another elastic band or um, scrunchy, I don't know what y'all call it. And I'm going to proceed to making my ponytail. I want a ponytail longer than this and because of how my hair is, I, I'm not able to put it on like this. Um, even though I put a piece of braiding hair in, I want it to blend in seamlessly. So what I'll do is I'll put about this half in the back or like three quarters of it in the back and the rest in the front and then I'm going to flip it all over. So this is how I proceed to do the ponytail, y'all. So I put this part in the back, this is gonna stay in the front, and this crunchy, I'm going to use to hold it all together. So I'm taking a piece of the shorter version or the shorter half to wrap around my base. Oh. I forgot I gotta talk again. <laughs> and then I section the hair into three so I can proceed to plait. So for a nicer finish, what I did was once I was getting down to the end of the braid, about an inch or two I added an elastic band. That will be where I'm going to put my curling rods. And then I wrapped that little piece of braiding hair that I had left around the base of my ponytail. I didn't use the hairpins because God knows I was not trying to take this hair down by the end of the night. So instead, I just used my Gots to be frizz spray and I secured it nice and tight. Because the ends were um, pre-stretched, it made it easier to do so. And then I used my Shannon Jam on my edges to make them look a little more sleek. So this is my ponytail. And I'm going to go ahead now and add the hot water to my ends. So yeah, so far this is what we got. I am loving it so far. Let's go add our hot water. Guys, just trust the process. I don't have to be a struggle buddy because my hair is of awkward length. I am just gonna clean this up nice and smooth with my scissors. After I hot water, I'll show you the finished look. I really do hope you enjoyed this look and the video if you did then don't forget to subscribe guys remember to like the video share with your friends leave me a comment the more you interact with me is the more likely YouTube will recommend my channel to others thank you so much for rocking with me so far I love y'all so much and I'll see y'all on Sunday